sitting here today as a member of the Detroit Pistons. You can look at it as you've got traded again, or you're with the Detroit Pistons, a team that's been to six straight Eastern Conference Finals. Your thoughts, sir? I look at it like um, I'm turning into a journeyman. <laughs> um, I just feel good about the situation, man. Just knowing the success that they've had before me and um, just wanting to come in and, and making them a, a, a better team. Detroit's always been a tough minded team, a, a, a mentally tough team. You know, I played in them in playoff series and played against them during the regular season. They was always that way. They never got rattled. They've been to the Eastern Conference Finals six times in a row. And I just want to be that missing piece that can, that can get them over the hump. You remember the first thought that went through your mind when you were told you're leaving Denver, you're about to go to Detroit, the Motor City, to play for Joe Dumas and the Pistons. First thing that went through my mind is getting it straight with my two oldest kids. And I explained to them that when you get traded, obviously the team that trades for you, they want you and they, they want to welcome you to their city. And once I explained that to them and, um, you know, helped them understand that they would meet more friends and they would see their other friends in the summertime, new teachers and new environment, everything would be cool. They was all right with it. Once they got comfortable with it, you know, I was happy and ready to go. A lot of times I see you now, you talk about, I ain't getting much younger. I'm, I, I'm a senior citizen yeah, in the yeah. league. <laughs> you trying to put me in a rocket chair. I, you know, <laughs> I can go with the best of them. <laughs> I mean, you know, I mean, you bring a guy 21 years old to deal with this 33-year-old guy. You know me, Steve. I'm going to tear his ass up because, you know, I got a bullseye on my chest. A lot of these guys watch me coming up. And... They lick their chops when they get an opportunity to get at me. And I know that. Going into every game, I know that some guy know that he has to play against Allen Ives and, and he want to get the upper hand on me. But I'm who I am. I, I, was, I was built like this. So I welcome all challenges. Last question. Is this the best chance you've ever had in an NBA championship? Best chance. Best chance I, I've ever had. And I know that. At a world championship? I know that. I know it in my heart. I believe it. My family, the people that love and care about me, believe it. Um, I believe it. And, and, you know, I'm just ready to, to take on the challenge.